a well-educated man of the 18th century would, would fully understand and appreciate that view behind me. That's, um, uh, it's just a public footpath on the map, but when you actually come here and see, it is a, um, a line of sight view uh, of, um, that goes all the way to, to some um, sort of uh, noble house in the background and beyond there there's some uh, the monument, I suspect it's the, uh, the monument in Savanac Forest itself. And yes, we're back in Savanac again, is this is number 10. Um, well, we're south of Savanac, we're in the same parish as, uh, as uh, Savanac was, uh, the parish of uh, Great Bedwin, and we're in Bedwin Braille, which is one of two Brailles here. I've described what a Braille is in the previous video. Um, specifically, I mean, uh, Castle Copse. And the reason why it's called Castle Copse is because it has a stone building. Castre is Old English, is probably its derivation, the Old English Castre, uh, which means sort of stone walls, stone rubble, uh, something along those lines. And, um, or Castel. Is it Castel? It's Castel. Uh, and uh, the, the reason um, why it's called that is because of the Roman road, uh, not the Roman road, the Roman villa. Um, that was found here, re replete with uh, mosaics, etc. So it's another. Um, this is another example of a lack of continuity from the Roman past. This is a Roman villa. The centre of a massive estate is um, completely lost to us. It's just rubble underground now. Um, no, you know, it's, um, the Roman past didn't project into the, the modern English future. Oh, stupid thing. Just lift him up and put him in the grass. <laughs> Come on. The weather forecast basically said that it was going to be like four days of rain and it's just been the four, best four days of summer this year and uh, really, really warm and sunny and nice. And uh, I don't know how they could have, the, the weather forecast people, the climatologists, whatever they're called, meteorologists, could it so massively wrong. So I made different plans for these days, you know, do indoor jobs. Don't laugh, but yeah. It's uh, this uh, land here. There's there's nothing here apart from a barn and a road, a footpath, and trees. And uh, in the 1700s, it was. You can see from the map that um, Beaten Path um, put me on to. It was only a tiny little bit was forested at that time. So all this wood has come back here since the 1700s since the 1770s and uh, it's, it is so far away from um, settlements it again shows that discontinuity with the ancient past uh, the Romans were here and then 
when they stopped being here, just everything collapsed. Even the villages weren't staying, even the peasants weren't staying. They went down, went down to the stream, went down to the river, made their settlement there.